because this is never before seen on camera, live footage of someone who's pregnant with a food baby. Let's see, ready? Yeah, hello everyone, I am Super Ganky. Welcome back to my channel. Ten days. Ten days no binging. And you know what happened? I found out that the girl I was dating was crazy. Why didn't I see the signs? Because I met her online. She was one of my fans. And for two months, it was all good. It was all good, man, no problem. Then one week, just one week, that's all it took. Tell me I'm pretty. Tell me I'm pretty. Tell me I'm pretty. You're not telling me I'm pretty enough. Whoa there, buddy. I'm not used to saying this stuff. Can you just give me a break? I'm gonna leave you forever if you don't tell me I'm pretty. I'm not even kidding. This is exactly what happened. And I'm not a pen doll. I'm not a pen doll. I got feelings. And if you tell me you're gonna leave me forever, just because I didn't give you a compliment to wake up to in the morning, or just because you think I'm gonna replace you with other girls, how do you think that makes me feel? It makes me want to binge eat. I'll tell you, that's how it makes me feel. I'm not gonna lie. When I made that last video, in 10 days, no binge eating. So I think that it has something to do with making these videos. So maybe it's an added layer of accountability. And because it worked so much last time, I'm making another one. It's not the first day I'm binge eating either. I binge ate yesterday and the day before that. What's happening to me right now? Why isn't this the last time? I said it was going to be the last time yesterday. What's wrong with me? It's not me. It's my bodily instincts because I'm not emotionally strong. And you're not emotionally strong. Even if you have willpower, the littlest things will tip you over. Bored. And it's usually going to be the things that are outside of your control. I couldn't control that girl in the way that she reacted to me. I liked her a lot, but how are you going to just like explode on me for things I didn't do? That made me feel really bad. And you know what? Usually speaking, binge eating happens either when you're bored, or when you feel really bad, or a combination of two. I don't even want to Twitch stream anymore. I've lost a lot of firepower here because I've given into the urges for three days. I've been masturbating, I've been binge eating, I've been wasting time playing video games. Stuff that just isn't conducive to a good mental state. Which is why I'm making another video. Restarting the challenge. Restarting it, man. I'm even making a manga. A manga categorizing my experience as binge eating. It is crazy. Cook for crazy. But, you know what guys, I don't feel bad right now. I'm going to feel bad afterwards, after I'm done eating all this food. I feel more fired up because we can change, but it's just hard. We can change, it's just really hard. And we're going to make so many mistakes along the road to change that we're going to think it's impossible. But it's not impossible. Let me tell you this. It's not impossible. It is possible. But it's not something our body can handle. We have to take it on with our minds. Because the body is influenced by outside sources. Things that can be outside of our control. The servant versus the master. And when we give into those urges, we're just being the servant. We're listening to the urges which are the master. We got to flip that around. Because if we don't, we're just going to be living by our urges for the rest of our lives. Wondering why we can't break our bad habits. 
Repetition is the key to making habits. But repetition of your bad habits makes the bad habits so much stronger. Am I still pissed? Yeah, I'm a little pissed that this girl hurt me twice in a row because I didn't give her a compliment. That was one. And then because she just thought so I was going to replace her with another girl mom, which was two. Things that are like so small, but like you're going to leave me for that? Like, wow, really? Oh my wow. But you know what? Fuel to the fire, man. That's a word she used. Fueled, man. And I know this. Because we're going to get to the relationship part of this video. Learn how to speak the language of love of your partner. Because if you don't know that, the time you spend with that person is not going to be effective. She was a words of affirmation person. I'm an active service person. And we just were not jiving on that level. Because I'm not used to telling girls they're pretty all the time. But that's what she wanted. And that's the update for today. I'm going to show you what it's all like because I'm starting to feel bad now. I'm starting to feel a little worse now. Here it is right now. We feel really, really bad. Let me show you a little bit about what it even looks like on my table. <coughs> Crumbs everywhere. Cookies completely destroyed. This is like, what, 15, 20 minutes at most. Absolutely horrifying. But I'm going to show you something even more horrifying in this video right now. Never done this before, but I, uh, I feel like you all need to see what someone's stomach looks like after the bend. So this is a little bit of what's going on under the hood. You see, I got a big chest, so no one thinks I'm fat. But after I bend, this is what my stomach looks like. Just so much fat and crap. Yeah, that's what it is. Um, this is this is it, man. This is the last time I do this for over 10 days at the very least. Um, I hope that something else of this proportion doesn't happen again to make you resort to binge eating. But well, thanks everyone for watching this video. Um, I'm about to go off to the bathroom. You know what's going to happen. But I'll see you tomorrow in the next video. Bye-bye.